Tonight, the Fernandina Beach community is fundraising for a 16 year old girl who's fighting brain cancer. Doctors diagnosed Mary Taylor with the cancer following a concussion. Cheyenne Cole is on your side this evening, speaking with the teen's mother, uh, the teen's mother's best friend, who set up a GoFundMe to help pay the family's bills. 16 year old Mary Taylor is recovering after undergoing a complicated 12 hour surgery to remove a tumor. Last year, Mary fell during cheerleading practice and went to the hospital with a concussion. That's how doctors found the cancer. I spoke with her mom's best friend who says she's been inspired by the family's strength. Since the day of her diagnosis, I've never seen her, I mean, I'm sure it's behind closed doors, but I've never seen her cry. She doesn't complain about it. She just, I mean, I would go visit her in the hospital during chemo and she would still have a smile even when she wasn't feeling good. During Mary's surgery, she lost blood flow to her brain. Now she'll have to relearn how to complete simple activities like walking and feeding herself. Christina Duffy says it's been hard for her to stop doing the things she loves, including cheerleading and horseback riding. Laura and I have been best friends for more than 25 years. And to see her go through this is one of the hardest things. And um, I just, I love them and I'm there every step of the way. And I'm so grateful to the community and how much they have just come together. She says she believes Mary's story can inspire others. If they just see her and they see her before pictures, the now and hopefully the after pictures that you can do it. You know, you just have to put your mind to it and we keep saying if anybody can overcome the odds that the doctors are telling us, it's going to be Mary. Mary will be in the hospital for another six weeks for proton radiation. You can find the link to donate to our GoFundMe by visiting this story on firstcoastnews.com. Cheyenne Cole, First Coast News, on your side.